All right, hey everybody, welcome back to round two of the water comparison series. Tonight we're comparing these five waters, and I'm going to decide which one tastes the best out of these five waters, and it's going to move on to round three. So right now it's about 4 a.m., and I'm going to try to keep this quick and fast. So here we go. First up is pure water with the high pH level, 9.5 pH level. Next up is karma wellness water. This water, you push down on it, and then like stuff vitamins and minerals and whatever shoots down inside of it and um, gives you wellness next up is sobe water this is a flavored water which has zero calories okay, next up is sanavi or sanavi i'm still not sure how you pronounce it and finally we have the interesting one this is archer farms um, so these four waters I reviewed like in the past month and I'm going to, you know, they, mo they moved on to round two right away. This one I reviewed over two years ago in January of 2016 and it never made it to round two, even though it was the winner because I couldn't find it in Target. This is from Target. It's Archer Farms water. And, um... My local Target just stopped selling it. And they finally brought it back with like a different bottle. Um, the label is a lot more clear now. And the bottle is a lot more squishy, which is kind of weird. Maybe it's a thinner plastic now, but I don't remember it being like being able to push my finger in like that. Um, so it's a, it's a new bottle, but it, it's still the same brand. So um, we finally get to review it. In my big water chart, it's just been sitting in the bottom corner. You know, it said disqualified for a while just because I couldn't find it anymore. But uh, we get to review it now. So let's just open them up and start drinking. Here we go. The pure water. It's with pure with an uh, pH, so it looks like fur water. A good solid water. Um, Sanavi. The name is Latin for life, I think. That's kind of weird. Um, this one tastes colder than <laughs> this one. They've been like in the same room for all, all day They're a little bit different temperature yeah it's a good one too another strong taste to it let's try the archer farms water <laughs> this one's not that good. This one's pretty bad. This one beats Smart Water somehow. Maybe they, maybe they when they changed the bottle, maybe they changed the water formula too. But this doesn't taste that good. This tastes like a tennis ball, kind of. Like has like a strong like rubbery not strong but like it has a mild like rubbery chemically taste to it yeah I mean it's not even like close I'm gonna, I'm gonna eliminate this right away actually you, you know Archer Farms you waited a long time but now you're out um now I want to decide between these two because to be honest, these two are not going to win. Because <laughs> they have so many other ingredients in these in these waters. Like this has like artificial sugar and stuff. These two are not going to win. But but I don't want to like mess up my palate with all their other flavors. So I'm going to save these for the end. And, 
decide between these two right away. Hmm. These two bottles are kind of similar. Like the pure one is just like a bigger version of it. You know, taller and wider, but it's like pretty uh, similarly proportioned. Alright. Uh, these are both very good. These two are both very good, very similar, very close. And um, I think, you know, this one is a lot better for the, for the pH level. Uh, this one was pretty acidic, if I remember correctly. But this one just tastes better. So this one is moving on to the next round. Um, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I still have to compare it to these two. <laughs> yeah, this is out. Uh, this one... I want to show you guys, because this actually looks interesting. You know, I, I would prefer just a standard still water, but I do think this is very cool. It's like, this is like a very unique bottle. Just cool design. So it says you peel and then you push. See all that junk it squirts inside of it? It's like extra vitamins and minerals and a bunch of junk they squirt inside of it. But I think this bottle is 25 calories. <laughs> so. You're also mixing that in with it. Alright. This one has a very strong smell to it. it smells like, uh, like Kool Aid or Hawaiian Punch or something like that. Yeah, it tastes like it tastes like Hawaiian punch. Here's the Sobe water from Giant Eagle. It smells like uh, like an orange. Yeah, I remember this one. This is the one that leaves like the sugary stuff on your teeth. This is zero calories, so it must not be real sugar, but it's like, it leaves like a sugary feeling residue in your teeth. Maybe aspartame or Splenda or something. Okay, so I'm going to eliminate these two because they have all that other junk in them. So the winner is Sanavi. Let's move it on to round three. Congratulations. 